Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here, one trailer at a time. Today, we're going to take a look at a brand new floor plan. This is a 2023 Flagstaff Classic, model number 826 BHS. It reminds me of a motorhome floor plan with a rear bedroom, side bunks, front kitchen, just less than 30 feet just less than 8,000 pounds. Super high-end finishes on this guy. Just an awesome trailer. This one reminds me of tank top season, and I'm here with my friend, that Dutch bad boy, Brendan Hanemeyer, on the camera today. Say hello, Brendan. What's going on, happy campers, future campers, and fellow salespeople? We're fired up to have these Flagstaff products. There's some really nice things coming in here, so we're gonna be posting videos of these all the time. You should hit the like and subscribe button. It's completely free to do that. We're on Instagram, we're on TikTok, and we're on Facebook. Having fun on all the platforms, producing some sweet reels on these awesome new trailers. Good luck keeping up with all the awesome things going on with this. Right on, right on, Brennan. Front power jack, 30 pound of paint tanks, battery in a box location here, just a mean look in front. Fiberglass cap, good you know looking, good looking you know brow, windshield in the front kitchen, painted cap, so it's not gonna change colors on you. Step back, Brennan. Look at how nimble this thing looks for what we're gonna get inside. We're gonna get to all that. Three Super slides on this, it's crazy. Yeah, and then look at like there's two big ones on this side. It looks like the whole thing is slide out. It's just awesome. We have electric jacks all the way around, outside spray port right there, outside shower, city water connection, tank flush. Black water flush kit, winterizing outlet, cable satellite inlet, a little bit of bonus storage right here in one of our slides. We got sewer drain down here, torsion suspension with Goodyear tires on this guy. And then what size do these be? 15s? 15s. 14s. 15s. Okay, good. <clears throat> <laughs> we got storage in through here, uh, and all slam latch doors, right? Metal slam latch doors held up by magnets. As we come down the back side here, we've got our 50 amp detachable style cord. We've got our roof ladder to get up on your roof and check your seals. Backup camera prep, class three receiver, and then down the door side, we've got a little more storage here in underneath our bed. We've got our uh, power cord in a handy bag, fresh water fill, outside tv location there's actually an outside griddle and an outside table it's going to clip onto that rail there six gallon gas electric water here roof ladder get up on your roof that's not a roof ladder brennan nope it's a, that's a hand hand grab handle, grab handle. <laughs> a little bit of autopilot here this morning outside speakers and then our electric awning starts here at the front goes all the way back there is a uh, like a metal shield on that awning, just protecting it, just in case you brush against some trees as you move in and out of the park. And then we have our furnace vent here, and then some more storage here underneath our front kitchen. Let's get this thing. Oh, let's do the travel access, right? Yes. All right, up and in. <clears throat> we can't get to the bathroom. That's all blocked off, but we can get to our kind of uh, front kitchen area, our, our dinette area, and our fridge here pretty easily from the side of the road. Let's get this thing opened up. Right on folks, we're inside that 826 BHS. Feel how long this thing is, it's less than 30 feet overall, but just feels massive as it just keeps on going. Here at the back, we've got our main bed, and that's out in the slide. So you've got all kinds of floor space in through here. Windows on both sides, reading lights, bedside tables, receptacles, cupboards across the top. Huge window here at the back. So imagine waking up, having a great view at the back side of the trailer. Another bedside table, another table over through here. Storage below the bed? There will be storage below the bed. A couple drawers. A couple drawers. You can see proof of all the aluminum framing in through here. We've got the outside storage we talked about when we were on the outside. And then on the other side of the bed, we have that other slide, right? So there's so much space in through here. We got this wardrobe right here. More of the same right here with shelving built in. Love that. And then four drawers, or sorry, two drawers down here with two cupboards right in through here. Look at all this space, Brandon. There's no carpet in here. Just finished off exceptionally. Elegant. And then we've got our bunks, and they're almost... Hidden. Hid well, they are hidden, right? Like, you don't even think about them. There's these bunks that are in behind these uh, curtains here. It's a good long bunk. Let me get this ladder out of the way to demonstrate the length here. I'm six feet tall. Let 
and I can lay in this bunk for sure. There's a light here, there's a window there. We've got storage below this bunk. Okay, and then we've got a pop down bunk here in the top layer. Boom, bringing that down. That's hiding another window, another really comfortable mattress in through here with a light and the slide ends right here. Now, you do have the bunk ladder to make that easier for the kids to get up and in. That's all slick. And then across from that, we have our washroom. Porcelain toilet in through here, lots of hip space, a great washroom, like a really great washroom in through here. Covered space there, covered there. That's just access to the back of the, uh, the water heater. Seamless countertops in the bathroom, undermount stainless steel sink, medicine cabinet, but then check these cupboards out right here. All right, we've got the fantastic fan in here standard, and then up into the shower, I'm six feet tall. Yeah, there's all kinds of space in here for me. There's a seat I can sit down and shave my legs, nice glass shower doors, big skylight, shower miser built into all these classics as well. And then, we're only halfway through, V. We've got this massive front living, front kitchen area. Over here, there's a three-seater um, uh, reclining action. That's facing our TV that's coming stock too. Windows in through here, nice sconce lighting. And then in the living space, you have the dual MCD shades. In the bedroom area, you have one shade. Uh, but yeah, so like a daytime right there and a nighttime right there. <clears throat> and then right here, Remember on the outside, we did have travel access to this with the slide outs closed. All right. Then we have a drawer here down below. Pantry location here. Solid surface in the kitchen and seamless in the bathroom. Pop down and then three drawers here built in. Soft closed drawers in our kitchen area. Cupboard space there for a garbage can and recycling. Undermount stainless steel sink with a rollover drying rack, pillow faucet, and this really brings it all together with that windshield facing out over the peasants. We've got a window here, glass stove top cover, oven down below, cupboard space right through here. There is furnace ducts built into the cabinetry, so you don't have any holes built into the floor at all. You're not stepping on the furnace ducts. We do have our bar stools here, our TV right here facing our theater seats with our sound bar down below microwave range hood and then our overhead cupboards just continue over in through here now before we quit the video brandon we do have a few things going on over here at the door there's a we rv connect where all our lights and our slides and our water pump and stuff like that will come together you can operate it from here operate it from your phone and then there's your charge controller right there controlling the amount of amperage coming off the solar panel on the roof i like that little light there too that's the video, folks. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Leave us a comment down below, and have yourself a good day.